Hello my YouTube beauties and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a top 10 under 10. That means everything can be found at the drugstore, either at Ulta in their drugstore section or Walgreens or on their website, something like that. All the products that I have here are under $10. I wanted to talk about some of the products that I found at the drugstore that I think are amazing. The first one that I have is this Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. This one is in Precious Petals. I will swatch it for you you can see that. This is a beautiful highlight. It matches my skin tone, so it almost just enhances my skin tone. It doesn't look like a highlight on the face like this one does. It matches my skin tone, so it just looks like I am just a little wet right there rather than wow, she has a highlight on. It took me forever to find it in the drugstore because it was sold out everywhere for good reason. And um, this is $4.99 at Walgreens. This is a great buy and the pan is huge. So that's a plus too. The second product I want to throw in here is the CoverGirl True Naked Goldens Palette. Let's be real. This looks like a naked palette. This is $9.99 at Target. So underneath that $10 with tax, it'll be above. I wanted to include it. I tried to find it as cheap as I could because so that I could include it in this video. These are all pretty much shimmer shades. You know, just keep that in mind that you cannot do really a full look with this. These products are amazing. They are so pigmented. That's some of them right there. I have high-end shadows that don't even look this pigmented. They are powdery, but I think they're totally worth it. If you have the chance, I would definitely go pick this up. They have a goldens one. They have like a nude and then they have more of a rose tone. And this is supposed to mimic I think the first one. The third item that I have to include is this LA Girl Pro Face HD Definition Matte Powder. I'll be honest, I just picked this up a couple days ago. It's what's on my face right now, but this is amazing at setting your makeup and making it last, and it keeps me matte. This is $6.99 at Ulta. There is like a little sponge back here. There's even like a mirror too. Right there. The packaging is a little bulky for a powder. I mean, this does such a good job. The product on the inside makes it worth it. It's so smooth. It is just so finely milled in there. So another product that I have to include is this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. This is probably gonna be in a lot of my favorites videos coming up. This is amazing. I have it on my skin today. It has like a little spatula at the very end. That's how you apply it on your face. You just Wipe it on your face. It does not smell the best, but I love the packaging. This looks high end to me. This is $5.99 at Walgreens. This is so pretty on the skin. It mattifies me and it keeps me matte throughout the whole day. It doesn't look like it's sitting on your skin. It is not cakey. It just blends in perfectly. And I could wear this every day for the rest of my life if I wanted to. This is probably my favorite foundation at this moment. The next product I have is the Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suit Matte Lipstick. I have two shades. I will swatch them. So this first one that I'm going to swatch is Give Me Mocha. I really like this shade. It is like my kind of shade. This shade is very much a brick shade, which I love. So this right here is Give Me Mocha. And then the other one that I've been loving is Rebel Rose. It's a little more mauve. This lighter one right here is Rebel Rose. And then this one is Give Me Mocha. I love these brick shades. Oh, these are probably my favorite lipstick formula. Best liquid lipstick formula ever. I can wear these all day long. And the other liquid lipsticks that I have, I can't do that. It gets too crumbly right here. These will come off maybe a little bit in the center of your lip when you are eating something that's oily. Again, with every other liquid lipstick, it's gonna be like that too because that's how you get it off. I wore this one for 10 hours a couple weeks ago. I touched it up once right in the center of my lip and that was it. It wasn't like they, they weren't crusty. They weren't sinking into my fine lines. They weren't drying my lips out. They are so comfortable. You'd think that you would be wearing nothing. Like you literally cannot feel this on your lips. These are amazing. They have tons of colors. So if you have the option to get them, I highly recommend it. And I did not even tell you how much they were. These are $4.99 at Target. So each of these is five bucks. Awesome deal for an amazing liquid lipstick. The next product I have is this Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Skin Transforming Powder. The packaging is quite bulky. I do not like this packaging, but this is the powder that I take with me on the go. It keeps me matte all day long. I really don't have to touch it up that much. It's just amazing. I don't really notice that it helps with like acne or anything. On the back it says that it has salicylic acid 
in it. I don't really notice a huge difference with that, but this is just a great, great powder. I have been applying it with a sponge. Don't like this sponge, but I can't really carry a brush with me. This is $8.99 at Target. This next product is from Wet n Wild as well. Man, Wet n Wild is killing it. I have one, two, three, four Wet n Wild products in here. Almost half of my items are Wet n Wild. So this is the Wet n Wild Mega Slim Skinny Mascara, and it has like the wand. You can see the wand at the end. This is what the wand looks like. It is perfect for your lower lash line. I will say that it has a tendency, so a tendency to build up product. So I'm trying to show you. So if you can look really closely, you can see some clumps on it. So I really have to work hard because it is such a wet formula to, you know, to not have the clumps on there when I am doing my low lash line because then I'm in the same problem that I had before was where it was touching my lower lash line. I love the length and I love the width of the brush head and it's just, it's really, really good. So. Yes, and this is $4.99 on the Wet n Wild website. I couldn't find how much it was on Walgreens, but I think it's very similar on Walgreens. The next item is the CoverGirl Outlast All Day Concealer. I used this in my last like current products that I'm loving video. This is probably my favorite concealer. It's what I'm wearing right now. It does an amazing job at covering your dark circles. It blends so easily and the formula is amazing. It doesn't start creasing or anything. So this is wonderful. I really, really like it and it's only $8.99. $9.99 at Target. The next concealer I have is this LA Girl Pro Conceal HD Concealer and this is a new one because my old one is way too dark for me. So I actually went and got the right color but I have used this product before. I know I love it. The applicator is is like this brush head which is kind of weird. It is very very full coverage. This is $4.99 at Ulta. And then the last product I have is from Revlon. It is the Revlon Color State brow pencil and this is $6.99 at Target. At the one end it has a spoolie which is actually it's really nice spoolie. 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 And then at this end is the product. So as you can see it is tapered so it actually works really well because you just kind of flick up and it is already like angled for that. This can get a little bit waxy so I always run it the spoolie through it again before I set my brows. This is what I have on my brows right now. I think this is a great alternative to the ABH brow definer um, or the brow whiz at the drugstore. Yeah it's just great. I mean overall the quality the formula is really really good. So that's all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and comment down below letting me know if there was something in your top 10 under 10 that I maybe missed out. I'd love to go try it. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss out on my future videos. Um, I do have an Instagram and Twitter so feel free to follow me there and then I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!